Hi, I'm Leslie Briones, your Harris County Commissioner, here to share some of the biggest wins from Commissioner's Court this week. To strengthen our efforts towards making Harris County more resilient against devastating storms, we approve the submission of 10 flood mitigation projects, including three in Precinct 4, to the Texas General Land Office, and these projects encompass a total of $150 million in grant funding. If awarded, the grant will allow us to complete much needed drainage improvements and upgrades across Harris County. We approved the Precinct 4 Healthy Parks Plan, a 14-month effort starting next month that will create connectivity between parks, unused green space, and neighborhoods. We really want to identify where are those opportunities to improve green space for you and your families, and we'll seek your input so that together we're creating healthier, more equitable parks for all of our families to enjoy. We also approved an agreement to develop an in-depth review of existing land use in the Katy East community to assess and improve transportation and mobility needs for that area. I'm also extremely excited and proud that Commissioner's Court approved the first set of appointees to the newly created Harris County LGBTQ Commission. I was honored to appoint Brad Pritchett and Dr. Maria Gonzalez as the Precinct 4 representatives. They are both proven advocates for the LGBTQ community, and I look forward to hearing their and the entire Commission's recommendations on tangible, actionable changes that we can make to better serve our LGBTQ residents. Because our goal is to make Harris County as inclusive as possible and to make sure that we're always enhancing everyone's equality. In another historic move, we appointed Afshin Davis to serve on the Harris Health System Board of Directors beginning this November. Ms. Davis will be, along with Seema Latavarjian of Precinct 2, the first people of Asian American Pacific Islander descent ever to serve on the board that oversees our county's hospital district. Ms. Davis serves as the Vice President and General Counsel for Texas Children's Hospital. She also had a leadership role at MD Anderson, and she brings a wealth of experience to the table in her knowledge of healthcare, health financing, and she's fluent in Urdu, Hindi, and reads and write in Arabic. Again, we need that diversity and perspective at the table so that all of our community is reflected. Thank you for being engaged in Precinct 4, and thank you for your commitment to working with us so that together we are always moving Precinct 4 and Harris County forward.